Hello everyone, Samson2, welcome to another mod overview, this time on Epix Utilities, a mod that adds a bunch of different ores, structures, a few different items to interact with time and weather, and yeah. So first we'll start off with the ores, and then lead on to a few of the other stuff later. So what you get is three different types of ores, you've got copper, time and water crystal, like so, which I'll place a few of them just in case for, depending on what I need to harvest, I'll we'll stop the rain here, get a multitude of picks to see what we want, so copper, the rest of these seem to be, I'm assuming, broken with stone, so you need wood or higher for Water crystal, time it seems you need stone or higher, possibly iron, perhaps that iron or higher for time crystal, unless it just doesn't break it at all. We'll see. Yep, so diamond, sorry, for that. And copper, I'm assuming iron or higher. And it does give you the ingot. So like so. Otherwise you've got the tools and sword, which you've got 400 durability and varying attack damage that's pretty much about diamond I'd say. Just obviously different durability for each, the sword being the second highest, pick being the highest, axe being a bit lower, and so on. You also have wooden armor, which is made from logs, I'm assuming just oak, it doesn't seem to be made from anything else. The tools are obviously made like you'd expect. Um, and they obviously have a bit in between, uh, we'll actually compare to gold and chain real quick, as well as leather, and chain will definitely want to since you can make chain in the mod. So we'll get some fire real quick. Comparison. Let's put some gold on. So 77, 112, so higher than gold, and you can obviously tell on the armor bar the equivalent there as well. Get leather, which is obviously following and that much in protection. Chain, obviously, and the fire again. So probably a bit under, I'd say. And compare the wood now, knowing that it seems to be under chain, just slightly in the comparison we see on the armor bar when it was displayed. We've got copper also as an armor set option, which is above iron but in between iron and diamond, and seems to be the same possibly on the armor bar, maybe a bit higher on protection there, but the durability is definitely a lot higher. Uh, obviously, broken texture on the items, but the actual wearing of it on your character is fine. Copper block also has a decoration block as well. If you want to use this for decoration, I would assume you'd probably need the same to break it as well. Otherwise we have the rain staff, which is made with three water crystals, and the only use for a water crystal. If you actually use it, of course, you'll change the weather to rain, and I don't think you can change it back. So if you wanted to have rain for whatever reason, you can now do that, but you will have to clear it with a bed or commands or something like that. And there's no durability for the staff, so you can use it as many times as you want. Otherwise we have the different structures which you can craft. I don't know if you can find them automatically. There is randomly generated ones though. Um, the tower is made with stone bricks, iron, any wood type, crafting table and furnace. If we go over to a different space, we should be able to see 
what's possible with it because I don't want to ruin some of the world gen. I'm not too sure about these sorts of buoys or something or boys. Okay, so if we do that and right click, it will take a bit to generate. There'll be dirt underneath. And there is a tower with some ladders, some chests that are empty, a bed, a ton of furnaces with obviously nothing in them, and a door that seems to have not spawned in correctly. Empty chests, crafting table, and so on. So you've got a pre-built structure you can live in of sorts. There's the house one, which is planks, stone bricks, and bricks. I'm assuming this may be the same one you can possibly... No, so they're randomly generated. They're not the same ones here. So we just try with this. Obviously, be careful when placing it, because it may take up space elsewhere. It does obviously spawn with grass underneath, or in place of grass probably. Stone bricks underneath. And like so. I don't see a door. Here we go. This side. It hasn't been placed correctly. You've got obviously brown stained glass. You've got some torches. You've got a table and chairs. You've got a fridge. You've got a chest. So a bunch of different things to start you off. And then the attic. You've got a bunch more you can use as well. Some empty chests, beds, and crafting tables and furnace. So if you want a, another pre-built option, you've got that. And finally we have the library, which is four bookcases, glass and planks, or bookshelves. And we'll try somewhere else over here. See if this actually moves some blocks in the area as well, which it may have that sand. Uh, let's see, but the door here, oh, two doors. Some torches that have fallen off, and we've got a library, like so, with some signs and things. And that's about it. So if you want a ton of bookcases, either for harvesting, for enchanting, we just want a structure to add to your world. You definitely have that. Finally, we have the sun clock, which is just two time crystals and a clock and a gold ingot. We've got the night one, which is obviously the same but with lapis. You can change it from day and night if you wish. At whim. Uh, I don't think we have durability with these, but we'll see. We'll just go on top of here. On right clicking, no, so you can just go between each of them as you wish. Otherwise though, that's about it. I could show the broken down structures, and they may have loot in them, but they can sometimes be tricky to find. So I might try that off camera, and I don't know if they're underneath the world. Uh, we might show world gen though, of um, ores, if possible, because that I can probably show off. Um, I hope. Let's see, I'm assuming it might be at the common levels, but I'm not too sure, I'm not sure what that is. Let's see what we can find. So we do have a bit of copper ore here, I'm assuming that is the exact same. Others though, I'm not too sure if they're at lower levels. We're at 12 right now, I'm not expecting the copper to be completely at level 12, but it may be most likely I can see from um, going through in spectator at least. Um, so got some iron, hard blocks, got some copper at level 30, some more copper at level 30. I'm assuming the others might be tougher to find, uh, but I don't think they're biospecific either. Nothing there. So probably not too much, but either way, some copper's still at level. 30 or 40 ish. Go a bit higher. Level 50, level 60. It's probably about as common as coal or iron for the most part. The copper. That's the only thing we can really find right now. Uh, but yeah. Otherwise, though, thanks so much for watching and goodbye.